Lemuel's here talking about testing electronic components. What is electronics? Electronics is a branch of technology that deals with many applications. Audio electronics, video electronics, digital, medical up to weapons, and banking are covered by the influence of electronics. There are quite a number of components used in the applications of electronics, like resistors, capacitors, inductors, and semiconductors. Electronic components have a number of electrical terminals or leads. These leads connect to other electrical components often. And let's move on to on how to replace different components. Computer parts replacement. When replacing computer parts and peripherals, you need to consider the following factors. First, compatibility of the components or part. Consider the component specification, components from factory. Compatibility of the component or part. When replacing computer parts, or you should check if it is compatible with your unit. Double check on your computer manual if the component you are replacing is compatible or not with the unit because this may lead to a system crash. Consider the component's specification. This focuses on the specification of component. Check if the voltage rating, current rating, memory size, and frequency matches your computer unit. 3. Components form factor. The components manufacturer should be considered. Check if the unit you are trying to repair or upgrade is generic or branded units. Branded units have their own set of components compatible only to their units, while genetic types can be used only to generic type of units. Lots of components commonly replaced in a computer system. We have the memory. It's technically any form of electronic storage. It is used most often to identify fast temporary forms of storage is commonly called RAM, Random Access Memory. We have the video card, also referred to as a graphics accelerator, is an item of personal computer hardware whose function is to generate and output images to a display. We have the network interface card, it is also known as LAN card, a PC interface to a network tumbling. It is a piece of computer hardware designed to allow computers to communicate over a computer network. Third is the hard disk drive, it is a fixed computer storage medium. Then, the motherboard is also known as the main board. It contains circuits that perform various functions. Processor is also known as CPU or the central processing unit. CMOS battery refers to small memory on PC motherboards that is used to store bias settings. And that's all for today. See you on my next vlog. Bye-bye.